I was in the Freshers' Fair in Queens about two weeks ago and I went into the UUP stall and I really clicked with the guys that was there. They were really friendly and welcoming. I wanted to meet people of my own political views, which is unionism. I was brought up a unionist and I want to make a difference, especially for the female generation aspect of it, because I feel politics is very male-sided and I want to bring in the female aspect of it. I feel like we're underrepresented almost and I feel like this is woman needs to step up. <laughs> I'm hoping to be elected in the Student Council at some stage and get to know, maybe shadow some of the MLAs and get to know the different roles and aspects that they play in Stormont. My personal experience with the Ulster Unionist Party has been nothing but positive. I entered into it last year and the only reason I joined was because I knew a friend in it. And within weeks I found myself so involved with the party Within the first few days we were meeting councillors, we were meeting MLAs and you felt a part of the family almost, not a party. And that's why it was so interesting for me. The last election we delivered over 20 canvases in 12 constituencies and it was absolutely tough work. Every day I was getting phone calls, I was getting texted here and there and everywhere but it was so rewarding. On the doors at the start, I'm not going to lie, it was absolutely heart-wrenching. I was nervous, I didn't know what to say. Some of them didn't go so well, but you soon got used to it. And every door you knocked and you gave them the leaflet, and then you'd even start to ask them questions. You'd say, do you have any issues that are important to you that you'd like me to answer? And you found yourself within minutes interacting with the people on the doors, and you found yourself selling your own party to the people. It made me feel, a far greater part of the Ulster Unionist Party. I felt that I was getting something as well as the people at the doors. I think people are tired. They're disillusioned with politics. But when they open that door and they see a young person, for some reason they think it's something different. They say, this is new. This is the upcoming thing. And I think the Ulster Unionists really stand for that. They stand for young people. We're the biggest unionist party in Queens because we take the young people seriously. We take ideas that they want and we do them. We do social events, we do political events. We're a large group of friends rather than just people interested in politics. I suppose that the greatest opportunities that the, the, uh, the young unionists provide to work internationally would be the um, International Freedom Summit which is, uh, this year was held in Porto and next year will be held in Helsinki. Um, the purpose of that is to bring together um, like-minded political parties that are interested in freedom and civil liberty and things like that, challenge them and make them think about you know, why they're in politics and what their purpose is and what they hope to achieve. We made sure that, the, uh, that Northern Ireland was firmly put on the map uh, on the international stage at those, those conferences. I had the opportunity to uh, attend the Peace Summit in Georgia to an extent share ideas uh, and share concepts about how to ensure that societies are moving in a harmonious direction. We are out internationally trying to talk to people and ensure that our message and, and our recollection of events is not forgotten about by history. Politics offers an unprecedented opportunity to shape where you're from and to improve where you're from. Um, why I joined the Ulster Unionist Party is because you know, I was really attracted to their vision. It's one of the best decisions I ever made and it's given me unprecedented opportunities. We're really interested in it and I would encourage people definitely to um, try it, try it and see. The party is going in a great direction at the moment and it's under great leadership. If you look at our team of MLAs, they are great. We have some of the best senior politicians out there and some of the new upcoming ones, absolutely great. And I, you know, I take a look at the members joining the YU today, and if even a small percentage of them was to go on to be councillors, MLAs, MPs, I think we're sorted. I think the future is very bright for the Ulster Unionist Party. The MLAs are so interested in the young people. If you are tired and you are disillusioned with politics, then don't vote for the same parties. And the worst thing you could do is not vote at all. Vote for the party that is going to make the change. Vote for the party. It's bringing the new way forward, which is the Ulster Unionist Party. Mm -hmm.